Hello everyone. Welcome to the pronunciation video series for Tieng Ang Tam, Global Success of Vietnam Education Publishing House. In today's lesson, we will continue to learn about stress in English. This pronunciation lesson focuses on sentence stress. We already had some lessons about sentence stress in the video series of Tieng Ang Sao and Tieng Ang Bei. So now, let's look at it again. You may still remember two types of words in English sentences. Content words, such as nouns, verbs, adjectives, adverbs, negative auxiliaries, and question words. And second, grammar words, such as prepositions, pronouns, articles, and auxiliary verbs. To sound more natural, we often place stress on the content words. They are pronounced with greater force than the other words in sentences. Meanwhile, we do not stress the grammar words. So in spoken sentences, they are pronounced softer, lower in pitch and faster. For example, look at this sentence and listen to me. I don't have a computer. I stress the content words don't, have and computer. I don't have a computer. However, in short answers, we normally stress the words yes and no. We also stress the auxiliary verbs am, is, are, was, were, do, does, did, will, have, can, may, etc. Those words are stressed because they carry meaning and help speakers clarify their responses. For example, look at the following dialogue. Can you point out which words are stressed? In this example, the following words are stressed. Now, repeat the sentences after me. Do you call her every day? No, I don't. Let's practice sentence stress in more examples. Look at the following sentences. Pay attention to the words in bold. Then, get prepared and repeat after me. Are you ready? Let's go. They are not familiar with that new computer. Did you lend her your laptop? Yes, I did. Who do you work with on Sundays? Was she checking attendance when you came? No, she wasn't. That brings us to the end of this video lesson. Now that you know how to place stress in sentences, it's a good idea to practice with any English materials you have. Sentence stress, along with intonation, will not only make you sound more natural, but also make communication easier. Have fun practicing and don't forget to practice every day. Bye bye.